Welcome to Fighting Stats, the ultimate channel for MMA fans who love statistics and betting breakdowns. I'm your host, Art C, and I'm here to get you ready for the upcoming UFC fights. In this series, I'll be watching tape and providing my real-time analysis on how I think the fights are going to go. I'll be watching for fighters' strengths, weaknesses, tendencies, and overall strategies, pairing that with Fighting Stats' exclusive UFC stats not available anywhere else to give you a prediction on how I think the fights are going to go and, ultimately, who's going to win. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Welcome to Fighting Stats. Welcome back to Fighting Stats. I'm your host, Artsy, and today we are continuing on with the fight tape of Garrett Armfield. He takes on Brad Katona at UFC 297. Uh, here, he, uh, uh, Garrett Armfield takes on Alex Macias. Uh, if you were with us in the last fight, uh, Garrett Armfield uh, fighting Mateo Vogel, uh, actually dominating that fight in the first round uh, and then losing by submission in the second round by rear naked choke looked pretty impressive. Uh, so we're going to continue the fight tape here against Alex Maceias. Uh, Garrett Armfield is going to be here on the uh, the right side here. So uh, we're going to see what happened in this fight. I'm going to get this one started. Uh, let's tailor the tape. Um, Alex is going to have a two inches of height. Looks like Alex missed weight here as well. Yeah, 39 years old. So... Uh, I think uh, Alex right now is a one and two record. Looks pretty old there, not gonna lie. Uh, here's Garrett Armfield here, uh, black trunks, red gloves. Let's see how. Let's see what happened here. Shamrock Fighting Championship here. Both fighters are off. Garrett Armfield or opened up Orthodox last fight. Opens up Orthodox here. Um, ooh, big right hand there misses. Another big kick there misses. Messi is looking for some big bombs. Got caught there already. This one's not going to go too long. Outside low kick from Macias. Armfield fainting the low kick here. Macias with his hands down pretty low. Nice right hand counter. Left hand Macias looking for a takedown. We saw uh, Armfield's takedown defense in the last fight pretty good. Good balance up against the cage. Macias really looking for a takedown here. Uh, not able to get it. Ironfield doing good. Nice underhook on that left side, bringing uh, Macias up. Oh, Macias got the takedown. But uh, it, I don't know if it counts as control here. Ironfield able to pop right back up. Good pop up. We saw that in the last fight as well. So here he's going to step over. He's going to put Macias on his back here. So now it's Armfield on top. Now we get to see some top time here uh, in full guard. Looking to step over there, uh, over that left knee of Macias into half guard. Uh, looks like he does that. So Macias is going to triangle that uh, left leg of Armfield. Armfield is working on the uh, hand position, the head position here. Working on some shoulder pressure as well. Uh, still half guard. The half guard's open now. Nice shoulder pressure. Macias trying to push those hips down, trying to regain uh, full guard. Uh, not able to do so just yet. Yeah, not a lot of space here from between Armfield and Macias. He's keeping good top pressure here. Uh, so um, hasn't really thrown a strike yet, so that's good. Really prioritizing the position over ground and pound for, for, for right now. Now he's throwing some punches now after he has the position. Some right hands there. Armfield still on top. Uh, Macias still putting the hands on the hips, trying to prevent uh, the, the pass. Armfield again, shoulder pressure on the head here. Trying to push down on that left leg, trying to get that uh, left leg out of the triangle there. There he got that a knee through, so three quarter mount. Uh, he just has to pop the uh, foot through. Mateus uh, able to regain that uh, half guard. 
Looks like he got back to full guard. One one butterfly in. Armfield steps over here. Almost in mount here. Mateus again regains guard. Back to back to half guard. So really fighting for position here. Uh, good top control from Armfield. Mateus looks to roll. Armfield, oh, it looked like uh, here. Nice bridge and uh, a reversal here from Mateus. Look like, yeah, he grabs the leg. Nice. Looks like it's going to get, uh, Mateus going to be on top, but Armfield transitions. He maintains the back control. Nice transition there from Armfield. Both hooks in, going to flatten him out here. Some uh, punches to oh, soften him up here a little bit. Using some ground and pound here. One minute nine or one minute thirty left. He's gonna grab that far underside wrist uh, and both hooks in. So again, he's gonna try to maybe flatten him out. Nice right hand there, trying to sink it under the chin. Looks like the elbow's under the chin. Now he's gonna go uh, rear naked choke. Mateus already uh, wincing, taps it out. So, Armfield round one submission. Okay, so uh, what did we learn? The Alex Macias, the level competition, obviously not great at 39 years old, but uh, Armfield doing all the right things, good scrambling, good takedown defense, good striking. Uh, everything so far looks so good. So uh, obviously he's gonna, he should have won the fight, and he did win first round submission. Uh, again, not bad, but from what I've seen so far, the strikings look good in the last fight against Vogel. Uh, the ground game looks pretty good. The scrambling looks pretty good for Armfield. So again, so far so good. We're gonna keep it up. We're gonna continue watching this Garrett Armfield tape and uh, we'll see if we can get you a best bet at the very end of it. Thanks for watching. Again, my name is Artsy. This is Fighting Stats. All right, guys. Well, that is it for today. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this sort of content, make sure you smash the like button, hit the subscribe. You'll get notified anytime we put out new content. And remember, here at Fighting Stats, I lead a team of expert data scientists. We are working around the clock to produce these exclusive UFC stats, not available anywhere else. We do our tape study. We pair them with our stats. We put out our best bets. We put our best bets to patreon.com slash fighting stats. That's where we put all our analysis, all of our stats. Join patreon.com slash fighting stats to get exclusive access. Recently, we just hit $82,000. Yes, that's right. $82,000 parlay on one fight. We use our fighting stats to get there, and we won a massive payday. Our Patreon members uh, had exclusive access to that, so they shared in the profits there. So don't miss out. Make sure you subscribe today. Again, my name is Art C. This is Fighting Stats. Thanks for watching.